Well, good morning everyone and welcome to the city of Doncaster. Today's date is Tuesday the 7th of June. This is a Travel Jack Jenny's. Roll the titles! <laughs> Doncaster London King's Cross Barrington Abbey Wood Romford Good Maze Tottenham Court Road Elizabeth Line Barrington Hello and welcome to another episode of Travel Jack's Journeys. On today's journey we shall be filming, and for the first time actually, yes, we're going down London. Now this is my 13th time going down London, but the very first time I've actually filmed it for Travel Jack's Journeys. Uh, basically today's plan is we're going to go and see the Elizabeth Line and go have a ride on it. Also a meeting with my beautiful girlfriend as well. Um, because usually, when I do these Londons, I don't tend to film it because it's about me spending time with my girlfriend. So, I thought I'd take you along for the journey. Um, my usual plan is down London. I get the stopper from Gould to Doncaster, which I've already done. And so I'm in Doncaster. And then I get whole trains from Doncaster to London King's Cross and then coming back I get whole trains from London King's Cross to Doncaster and then get the Northern whole service which goes via Gaul back to Gaul. Today's train plan we are going to be catching the 0721 whole train service to London King's Cross. We are calling up Retford, Grantham and London King's Cross. We're there at 0914 and then coming back, we're on the 2030 Hull train service to Hull, putting up Grantham, Retford, and getting off at Doncaster. We're back into Doncaster at 22.06. Now, as I said, the plan in London is there is no plan apart from we are going to go for a ride on the Elizabeth Line. Sit back and enjoy this journey. I'm going to enjoy it because this is now the 13th London journey that I've done. What should I do? I shall film the whole train arriving into Doncaster. So I'm not sure which one it is. We think it's 802 305. We're thinking, but we're not sure until it turns up because myself and Georgie, we quite like whole trains. That whole trains are our favourite train operating company. We like their trains as well. So that's why on a London I always come down on whole trains. Let's stop the talking, let's get on the train down to London King's Cross. Should be a good day. Here comes my train, this is the 0721, whole train service to London King's Cross. This is 802 
303 operating 721, half train service to Luton King's Cross. Gentlemen, and very warm welcome aboard this C722 on Hull Train service to London. This service will call at Redford and Bradford and has an arrival time into London this morning at 9 40. First class combination can be found towards the front of the training coaches E and D toilets are situated throughout. Passengers are requested to store any large items of luggage in luggage racks provided. Placing any smaller items in the overhead racks. Please do not block any gangways, doorways or aisles and please keep back free from seats and tables. In the interest of safety and security, please keep an eye out on all personal belongings throughout the journey. CCTV is in operation recording on this service. Safety information posters can be found throughout the train. Please familiarise yourself with these. And if you do see anything suspicious whilst on board today, please inform the member of group or alternative protect the British Transport Police on 61016. This is the 721 full train service. The next stop will be Redford. <laughs>
shortly be arriving at Grantham. If you're leaving the train, take a moment to check you have everything with you. Please take care when leaving the train. Use the handrails provided as the step down to the platform is larger than usual at this station. Going up to one in the north, where 
go over the one in Viaduct. Now, what's happening is 
EFL rail that runs from Reading to Paddington and Liverpool Street to Shenfield has been rebranded as the Elizabeth Line. And there's also some new a new line that's opened under the centre of London that runs from Abbey Wood to Paddington. Uh, new stations include Tottenham Court Road, Farrington, Liverpool Street, Whitechapel, Canary Wharf, Custom House, I think one of them is, and yet yeah, Abbey Wood there, the new stations. That section has been giving five minutes at the moment. Now, later in the year, I think they are I think they are going to get it so the trains from Shenfield to Liverpool Street will run into Paddington via the new tunnel. Because there's a branch that comes out at Whitechapel and takes the trains up to Stratford. And I think there's a line that yeah there is the building a line from Paddington to Reading, which connects just before I think it's Acton Main Line. Obviously this bit I'm talking to now, I'm actually on board a northern train service. Because I'm actually using this train to travel from Gaul down to Doncaster. Yeah, so that's a bit about the tube map. Now, get around London. I use not my tube, I use an Oyster card. This one is the page you go one. Or the host tap it on the barrier and tap it when I go on the on the train. And on the bus I'll be tapping. That's what I've got in it, so it saves a lot of money using a tube that way. But you know at London King's Cross, where this service terminates. Before leaving the train, take a moment to check you have everything with you. Don't forget any bags or cases in the luggage racks or under seats, and retain your tickets as they may be required when exiting this station. Please take care when leaving the train. Use the handrails provided as the step down to the platform is larger than usual at this station. Thank you for travelling with whole trains today. We're now approaching London King's Cross, where this service terminates.
Right, we've now arrived at London King's Cross. It is 9.15. We're due out at 8.30 tonight. Hello, lovely. Hello. Yeah, the experts here. Have you got any meat? Have you got, have you got some tube flaps for me? No, there wasn't any down there. Oh, it's all right. Well, there was one by the machines. So I will get some tube maps later so I can show you the new Elizabeth line. Oh, yes. Now, we're currently going to wait 15 minutes here before we go on the tube so we can get the off-peak fares. Well, I can. Because we like cheap fares, don't we? Oh, yes. Yeah, so this is why we come down. This is why I haven't filmed London. So I like to spend time with this one. Thank you. We did get a kiss today. Oh, well. <laughs> And we'll be doing some holiday journeys later this year. <laughs> Where are we going? Scotland. You want to get yourself out there? Yeah, Scotland, aren't we? Yes. And, and, and we're going to be filming some York journeys as well. Loads of them. Right, we're going to spend some time with spend some time with my lovely girlfriend. Yes, we are. Thank you. Right, it's just turned 9.30. Oh. By my watch it has. Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to go one stop down to Farringdon and jump on the Elizabeth line to Paddington. So little Georgie can say hello to Paddington there as well. <laughs> Not big Georgie, little Georgie. Because you've already seen Paddington be there. <laughs> so is little Jack, but he's up north somewhere. He's with me, Mum. Hi, Mummy. Oh, this, right? this is an essay. Uh, this is a Right, we're now on the Elizabeth Line platform. This is platform B. We're going to take this to Paddington. We're going to stop at Tottenham Court Road and then Paddington. 
not stopping at Bond Street because the station is running a little bit late. And later we'll do the other bit of the Elizabeth Line up to Romford. Hello. Hello. You live on the Elizabeth Line, don't you? No, see. The original section. I love this effect, that's brilliant. Are you recording this? Yes, I am. And the yeah. train approaching platform B is the service to Paddington, not stopping at Bond Street. This is the same voice on my departure board. Yeah, but I And they did say to me in the front frame. Here it is. Three, four, five, oh, fifteen.
street we're going through. At the moment it's not open. We are at London Paddington. Now they've moved Paddington Bear. Mm -hmm. They've moved Paddington Bear, it's now the Impact Yeah, which is on. I've got the new tube map here. Thank you to my girlfriend for getting me some tube maps. Love you. He just dropped me out of you. <laughs> yeah. Right, let's have a look at this tube map. Why are they called it a tube map? Yeah, the, there's the Elizabeth Line. Now there's an extension for the London Overground to. Barkin Riverside. Yeah, so the Elizabeth Line is now in. Excellent. And they've left Thames Link in as well. So yeah, it's they call it the tube map when it's got Elizabeth Line, which is technically National Rail. It's got the Overground, which is technically National Rail. It's also got trams, which is not a tube line. And it's also got Thames Link, which is certainly not a tube line, it's National Rail. Really? Now I'm going to do an interview with my girlfriend. You live on Elizabeth Line, don't you? Well, not on the Elizabeth Line, close. Yeah, you know what I mean. Do you like it? It's cheap. Hmm? It's cheap as well, yeah. Well, I don't get to see it past my house, that's what you're talking about. Oh, yeah, you, yeah, we won't say where you live. Nope. Link. 
that will keep that one secret. If you want to check where Georgie lives out, she lives in, I don't know, Birmingham, Birmingham whatever it is. Whatever it is, uh, Liverpool, somewhere, wherever. I'm in London. You enjoying today? So far. Yeah, I so, you um, see right now. Yeah. yeah. So we're going to jump back on the Elizabeth line in a minute and head to Abbey Wood, the end of the current terminus of it. Yes. And then we're going to go somewhere nice for to eat. Yes. Pastry and Lombard yeah. yeah. Then possibly later on in the series, unless this is actually being filmed late after that, we'll visit some of the other stations as well. So we've done Paddington, tick. We've looked around Farrington, tick. So we need to do Tottenham Court Road to do. Uh, what else do we need to do? Liverpool Street, we're doing that later. I'm going to check the map actually to make sure we get the right stations. <laughs> I mean, you could always even get the greater angular from Um Yeah, we need to do Canary Wharf, Custom House, Abbey Wood, and we also need to do a white chapel as well but we can do that later in the series but yeah we'll take off some station as well yeah so we're going to go and jump on the elizabeth line hold that please oh, please this directly onto the ticket hall that's amazing oh, to be honest this is brilliant i love i love this effect this the sky that's actually a sticker not real but yeah it's actually brilliant as anything Let's jump on the Elizabeth Line. Oh, I should point out the trains are not stopping at Bond Street at the moment, in case I haven't made it clear. They're running a bit high with Bond Street, aren't they? Yes, they are. And you can use Oyster cards on the Elizabeth Line as far as West Ely, I think it is, or whatever it is on the tube map. Right, we're on platform A. We are going to catch this train, which will be here soon. We're going to go all the way down to Abbey Wood. Right, we're on the Elizabeth line. We're going to go to Abbey Wood on it. I'm not, sh I'm not sure which train number it is. Or it's... I don't know. I'll find out later. Right, we had some technical difficulties. That's why this train is running good. A couple of minutes late. Abbey Wood via Canary Wharf.
next station, Tottenham Court Road. So that means we've nailed in Farrington to Pennington, both ways. We're now going to do Farrington to Abbey Wood. And later we'll do the last remaining section between Liverpool Street and Farrington. This is the train to Abbey Wood via Canary Wharf. Liverpool Street. Change for Central, Circle, Hamsworth City, Metropolitan, Northern, London Overground Lines. Station Whitechapel. Oh, 
go away before that. So when you turn to the next again? This is the train to Adam. Sunday the 3rd of July. Because it, it fit the online payment okay. pocket, put that forward. Okay. Well, you, you have to manage your pocket, don't you? So then, with these in temperature, it's a difficult one for me. Even she's not. We have now arrived at Abbey Wood, where the train actually terminates. That was quite a nice ride, actually. I really enjoyed it. Uh, we're going to we'll jump back on the train in a bit. Did you enjoy it? Yes. Hello. It's lovely. I'll get a picture of this train in a minute. Hello, everyone. Now 
are the Abbey Wood. As you can tell by my lovely sister with the camera, it's very nice and airy around here. Yeah, it is. Very open, it's quite beautiful actually. Mm. Lovely exterior and the interior. We're soon we shall be making our way to Rockford. Yeah, we're going to go via Liverpool Street. <laughs> Since there's something quite interesting at Liverpool Street that I want to go and have a ride on. Could be the shortest railway in the country. Lift, ride, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> Train yeah. services here every five minutes to Paddington. Lovely chapter. Right, before we go and jump back on the Elizabeth line, it's taken around 35 minutes to get from Paddington to Abbey Wood. That's not bad going actually. So we're going to go and jump back on the train in a minute. Back on the train. We're now going to go to Liverpool Street to jump on the other section of the Elizabeth Line, the original bit, your bit. And so I won't, I won't film it on this, this on this section. This is the train to Paddington. We will shortly be arriving at Liverpool Street. This is where we're going to change from the train to Romford. So I shall um, end the filming. Well, now I'll carry on filming, won't I? I won't show you much of Romford. It's not that. Yeah. Not the best area, if I'm honest. But yeah, we're just coming into Liverpool Street. Right, we are at London Liverpool Street. Uh, we are going to catch a greater angular service to Romford, which I believe is the Colchester town train. I think it's going to be a 720. This is 720 537 operating the 1236 greater angular service to Colchester town, taking this train as far as Romford, going out Stratford and Romford. I'll do a little bit of filming along the route. Technically we could have got the Elizabeth line. This is quicker. And it's fewer stops and we'll probably jump, well go past a few of the Elizabeth line trains. Over there is one of the old ones. Oh, gotcha. But they won't be in for much longer.
Over there is the Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park. And we are shortly arriving to Stratford. We can change for the DLR and the Jubilee now. Also London Overground. And nope, this is not Stratford up on A1 and near Birmingham. This is Stratford as in London. Stratford, the doors will be open in the left hand side as we're going to platform 9 here at Stratford. So the next station stop is Stratford and the doors will be open on the left hand side. Thank you. We're now departing Stratford of an Avon. I mean Stratford, the next stop will be Romford.
reason why I'm going to be going around with a train because you overtake a Lisbon line train. Right, so that was good news, that's where we're coming back later. It's bad enough when I go to Romford. Next one is Chadwell Heath. Yeah. Next one's Chadwell Heath. Twelve fifty-five. We're now here at Romford. This is actually my princess. Is one of the local stations, ain't it? It is. Now, me and her are going to have some time together. We'll resume. We'll re we'll resume the filming later. We will resume at Good Maze later on this afternoon after I've got the bus from where the princess lives to Good Maze. Right, we are at a bus stop. This is where we're going to leave the princess. Well, I'm going to head home. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean. Yeah. Lovely. 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 As you see in a few weeks. Less than two. Less than two. By the time this goes out, I would have already seen my beautiful girlfriend. And we've had a week's anniversary. Yes. Year anniversary. Year anniversary. Yeah. Week's holiday. Yeah. Week's holiday. Week. We'll film some journey. Some of them we won't film, but some we will. Thank you, princess. <laughs> She's lovely, she is. And yeah, what we say where we're going, yeah, you have to try that in the video. Yes. We'll find out later in the series, unless it's already gone out before this. Yes. Love you. Love you. And I'll have a safe journey home. You can well, you can text me. Yes, I will. I'll keep messaging you. See ya. Hey. We're now going to get a bus to Good Maze, which is very good indeed. <laughs> then we'll get the TFL Rail. No, Elizabeth Line Elizabeth to Liverpool Line. Yeah, correct that, Jack. I'll yes. For your viewers. <laughs> Elizabeth Line, not TFL Rail, because TFL Rail does not exist anymore. We've just jumped off this bus, which is the 364. We're now going to go catch the Elizabeth line to Liverpool Street, and then we'll go down onto the low level platforms A and B. We're we'll going to Tottenham Court Road to have a look at that. Here comes our train 345 063. This is the train to Liverpool Street. Next station is Liverpool Street. 
service to Liverpool Street. This is actually part of the old TFRL service I used to run from Liverpool Street out to Shanfield. So we're going to take this train to Liverpool Street and then we're going to go on to the two low level platforms. At this time our train that we're catching back is leaving Hull. <coughs> Потому что получается, Янукович был президентом, он все подписывал договора с Путиным. Европы. У нас так получается, половина Украины едет, приехала в Россию на работу, а половина в Европу. Польшу в это. Едем в Европу, типа, говорим, что в Европу надо ехать. А он был оттуда, с Донецка. Он типа. Президент Евросоюза там было, он больше не подписал. Люди больше ничего не подписал. Мы таким, ты должен делать то, что народ хочет. Мы таким. Взял и подписал, блядь, нет. Начали бомбить, все придали, может быть, убежал. Вондрал все министры, убежали, депутаты, ну то прорывы убежали, все зим партии убежали. И все. А началось там, началось такое, вышли студенты, потому что. Любой студент, посмотрите, возьмите московский диплом, куда с ним пойти, кроме России, либо же, а возьмите в Бухарейский диплом, работайте в Сумин. Говори, вы будете в Бухарейский диплом, куда надо идти, в Европу. Много кто едет, будет там больше, но в этом ее диплом признается во всем мире. Есть у нас в Украине некоторые там, которые признаются, но не, 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 не любой, как в Румынии, в Болгарии, выучился в любой диплом, где работает любой стране. Это так, внимание. Иди, на Я выезжаю от России, 
постоянно там торти. London Overground Lines, DLR, and National Rail Services. Next station, Stratford. Are you talking about it? 
Right, it's just come 1740. This is where we are heading down onto the Elizabeth Line low level platforms. That will take us to Tottenham Court Road. We're going to look out Tottenham Court Road. We've got ages before our whole train service back up to Doncaster. One thing I love about the Elizabeth Line trains, air conditioning, fantastic. And they've got Wi Fi apparently. Don't know if it works. I asked Georgie, she, she might be able to test that out for us. Hi Georgie, if you're watching. Right, this is where you go to get the Elizabeth line. Go into the entrance, that takes you to the underground, but turn right after the barriers, that'll take you to the Elizabeth line. Sign lifts now working, so we'll go for a ride on it. Really? Yeah. 
this morning. Excellent. Let's continue to catch the Elizabeth line to Tottenham Core Road. Escalator veg time. in three minutes to we'll take that one too. Change for 
Circle, Metropolitan, Hammersmith and City, and National Rail Services. Now I made it to Tottenham Court Road. Now I believe this brings you on Oxford Street. Yeah, it does because there's loads of shops. I would show you a bit of Oxford Street, but the problem is there's people playing music and YouTube might get us into trouble for that. But yeah, Tottenham Court Road brings you on Oxford Street. Very good. And it's loads of buses and traffic. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go and tap back in, get the train one stop to Farrington, and then get the Met Line to King's Cross. Technically, I could get the Northern Line from here, but the thing is, this is about the Elizabeth Line, not the Northern Line. So I'm going to go and tap back in, and we'll go one stop to Farringdon, and then we'll make our way to King's Cross, and that's where we'll end the sightseeing here in London. But yeah, Oxford Street is very busy. This is just a small glimpse of it.
Let's go and get the Elizabeth Lion one stop to Farrington. Right, just going off the escalators. Now, because these trains are nine carriages, you do need to make sure you are in the right part of the train to be at the correct exit. Now, there is a handy guide all over the internet that will help you do that. Uh, I'm going with to Farrington, so I need to be in the rear three coaches. Otherwise, you've got a very long walk. Um, because some of the platforms are like that long, they actually back onto another station. So you like the, Liv the Farrington entrance, if you get on at the wrong end, you're actually at the Barbican end. You don't want that. Uh, platform numbers, it's platform A towards Shenfield and Abbey Wood. Platform B towards Paddington. So you think A for Abbey Wood and B for Paddington. So we're going to make our way towards the back end of the train. There's a train during three minutes. If not, there's one in eight minutes. Now we need one stop on the Hammersmith and City Metropolitan line or circle. A is the service to Abbey Wood. Well, this will do. Train coming.
we started here at Farrington. And this is what I mean about the exits. Farrington, Barbican that way, Farrington that way. I really enjoyed that actually. So now I'm going to go one stop on the tube. Right, that's it from the Elizabeth Line. I'm now going to make my way onto the traditional tube and get the Metropolitan Line or Circle and Hammersmith. Luckily they're S, the S stock and they've got air conditioning trains. Yes, I've really enjoyed it. Yeah, so make sure you are in the right part of the train. I go in carriage six. I need to be in seven. Let's do one more escalator ride. And this one looks a very long one. Nearly half six, Farringdon Elizabeth line there, and Thames Link. Underground one, just here. Let's do one stop on the tube.
Mac 就是这个纸和这个纸按，然后 Windows 就这个纸和这个纸按。这手还是比较娇小。比如如果说那个，比如说我打了一个 sentence， 然后我现在的光标在那个末尾，那我的话直接按那个 command 和左键头，它就到句首了。The tube. Well, one stop on it. Don't mind it. I'm going to head outside and get some fresh air before my train, and I'll let you know what the train plan is back to you. Well, Doncaster, I'll finish at Doncaster. It was very excellent. I right, the last time, it's half out. Right, we're now back at London King's Cross. This is where I'm going to take a break for a bit. Breather. Uh, return train plan, we're waiting for the 2030 old train service to Hull. Take that train to Doncaster, calling at Grantham, Retford, and Doncaster. June Doncaster, 2208, possibly a little bit early. It's been a fantastic day, I'll, I'll do a proper review later on. Off a show film with the train going up to Doncaster. Right, we're on the platforms here at London King's Cross. Our train's turned up. This is Hull Trains 802302. Excellent. So we've had 304 down, no, 3 down, 2 up. Not bad. On my birthday journeys, I had. Two, no, one, two, four and five. Yes, yeah, so that's quite nice. So this is our train. Back to Doncaster. Georgie's on the camera. I'm going to get some pictures of this train before we, before we board it. This is a Grand Central leaving. This is my train back to Doncaster. 
This is A22302, operating to the 2013, whole train through Vista Hull, taking this train as far as Doncaster, calling up Grantham, Redford and Doncaster, Magenta Doncaster, 2208. <laughs> Thank you. 
very smooth, quiet, air conditioned, fantastic. And a little bit around Abbeywood. And then we got the train up to Liverpool Street. And we jumped on our great angular zoos down to Romford. Uh, one foot I stopped at filming, it's been a bit of time with my girlfriend. Then we you know, went over to where she lives and we got the bus to Good Mace. And then I jumped on the Elizabeth line to Liverpool Street and then went down onto the low level platforms, had a ride on the incline lift which wasn't running in the, in the morning. It was our service. Elizabeth Line went to Tottenham Court Road. That was quite a nice station actually. Whereas that stops you in Oxford Circuit, Oxford Street. Lots of shops there. And then I did one stop back to Farrington. And then I got a Hammersmith and City Line train to King's Cross. Then I boarded this train back to well, heading to Doncaster. Now I've used this Oyster card, this one, for the last 12, 13 trips now. But now a new Oyster card has taken over. Doing these limited edition Elizabeth Line Oyster cards, which I've decided to keep my old Oyster card as a souvenir. Not also that marks 13 trips, it also marks one year of me doing London, so I've had this. So now from this Oyster card to the Elizabeth Line one. This is a great souvenir of today's journey as well. Um, that's it for me, for the review. I shall film the approach onto who I went to Doncaster. I'll keep you informed if we have any more problems. The last thing will be the train leaving this train leaving Doncaster because I'm not going to film it from Gore, well, Doncaster to Gore. So it's the only one I'm going to do Doncaster and then this train will be leaving Doncaster. Thank you to my beautiful girlfriend for joining us on today's show. She's the producer. I think she really enjoyed it tonight as well, which is good. Me and her have been together now for one year. So I do these little trips once a month to come and see her. Don't know if I'll film any more little trips, but if we do, hopefully we'll do some more sightseeing ones.
Doncaster, changing the staircase to Scunthorpe for into the Cleethorpe, to Sheffield, Leeds and York, Manchester and the Midlands, and to stations in the north and northwest. If you are leaving the train at Doncaster, please remember to take all luggage and personal belongings with you. And please mind the step down on, from the train onto the platform. On behalf of myself and the rest of the onboard crew, I'd like to thank you for travelling with us today. I hope to see you again in the very near future. Doncaster will be the next station stop. Yeah.